Hello guys and welcome back to Living in the High Desert. I always get this question, what zip code or what area is the best place to live here in the high desert? So that's what we're going to be talking about. Let's get into it. So I really wanted to talk to you about this topic. What's the best area to live here in the high desert? Victorville, Apple Valley, Oak Hills, Hesperia. You already know guys. Okay, so I always get this question. What's the best zip code? What area do you recommend? Uh, what's the best neighborhood? That's another one, okay? <laughs> what's the best neighborhood? Uh, uh, is it to live or to move in to the high desert? I'm coming from Los Angeles and I'm gonna be renting or buying a home. And I get it guys. You want me to go ahead and just answer and give you a zip code? A lot of you guys actually send me text messages with like, oh, I'm going to be renting a house on Bear Valley Road and um, what's another good road and Hesperia Road. Uh, make a right and that's where the house is going to be. How is that area? Okay. I get it, guys. You guys want me to tell you what i think about the neighborhood is it a good neighborhood is it a nice area you have a lot of questions you're moving up to the high desert you're probably looking for a, a rental that's cheaper i understand everybody's doing that right now everybody's just looking for a, a cheaper place to live and that they can afford okay but what i need to tell you is that i can't go ahead and just send you a zip code because you need to keep in mind if I send you a zip code, even in a zip code, okay, there's going to be areas in that zip code that are not the best areas. Okay, so if you're asking me, uh, can you uh, tell me if what zip code is the nicest area here? The high desert is just like every other area's in Los Angeles, in the England Empire, in Riverside, everywhere in San Diego, in LA, okay? You're gonna have a nice neighborhood and the next street, it could be a not nicest or safest neighborhood, okay? So I really can't tell you just because you send me a text, I can't really tell you if that's a safe area or it's not a safe area. You need to understand that I do not live in all of the high desert. We do sell houses here in the high desert in Victorville, Apple Valley, Oak Hills, Hesperia, but we don't live in all of the areas. I get your frustration because I think some of the texts, when I do receive a text asking me, I, I do tell them that I can't really send you a zip code or tell you what area because every area is gonna have their bad areas. Okay, so I need you to keep that in mind. Just like wherever you're moving from, I've been getting a lot of calls or text messages from people moving up to the high desert from LA. It's gonna be the same thing here, okay? So you're gonna have a nice area with a nice street, everything's good, and then you're gonna be going to the next street and it's not the best area. So I really can't recommend a zip code or a little area and tell you that that's gonna be the best area for you to relocate and move to, okay? I do have videos on my YouTube channel that uh, I do drive, like a driving tour of the neighborhood so that you could take a look and see how it looks. But we really can tell you as realtors what's the safest and what's not the safest because we don't know. Um, that information, okay? Because you can be living in the safest area and something can still happen in that area, okay? Uh, your car can be broken into, your home can be broken into, um, anything can happen, okay? So we really can't go in ahead and send you a zip code or send you uh, a neighborhood. I could kind of try to explain to you about the neighborhoods, but you have to get on a phone call with me. I can't do it through text because a lot of people, 
want to send me a text and they don't want to get on a phone call, um, I can only give you so much information via text message. I can't really give you or explain to you what I feel about the neighborhood or how it looks or what's really going on in a specific neighborhood if you don't get on the phone. And then I can go ahead and try to explain to you what I think. But again, this is just what I think. It's not really what it is, okay? So I hope that this makes sense, that I understand that you're wanting me to answer what's the best zip code to live in, what's the best neighborhood, but I need you to understand that us as a real estate agent, we really can't, we don't really know that information. I could tell you, well, you know, okay, yeah, this is a nice neighborhood, but even that nice neighborhood is going to have not a nice neighborhood next to it. And maybe that's where the rental that you're looking into is located, but I wouldn't know that. Okay. So I hope that you could take advantage of all of the neighborhood tours that I do have on this YouTube channel so that you can go in there and see the neighborhoods and uh, get a better understanding for the neighborhoods and the area. Also, I always recommend that you come maybe on a weekend, rent a hotel room, come to the area like Friday, Saturday, Sunday, go at night, check out the area where you're gonna wanna move to or buy a home in, and you can do that as well. Okay, so that way you can get a better understanding, uh, understanding and feeling of the neighborhood for yourself. Okay, because if you ask me, I'm really not going to be able to pinpoint that information for you. Okay, I hope you guys understand that I'm here to answer all of your questions, but there's certain things that real estate agents can't really answer. And I hope that this information really finds you well and you kind of understand why why it is that we can't answer what's the uh, best neighborhood or what's the best neighborhood by zip code, okay? I hope I was able to explain myself. Thank you so much for watching. Again, Angelica Bonilla here with Excellence Real Estate here in the HD and the Bonilla Group. Thank you so much for watching. Bye-bye.